Renowned turf expert and golf course superintendent Matt Schaefer has worked for decades at some of the most recognizable golf courses in the world and now runs his own company, Minimalistic Agronomic Techniques. He's a champion of the less is more philosophy when it comes to turf management and has a lot of wisdom to share. My dad was a taskmaster. He was, he was a great guy. He was philosophical and everything, but he was about hard work. You know, and to this day, I can't get up and not do something productive. And he loved golf, so he was going to build a golf course. At an early age, Matt helped his dad with golf course construction work. So he's been around the industry for nearly his entire life. And that's how I really got rolling, because he had me out there clearing property. And I met Jeff Cornish. So I ended up uh, finding out that you go to college for turf. Matt attended Penn State University and graduated from their prestigious turf grass program, meeting mentors along the way. When I graduated from Penn State, there was a three ring binder like this with superintendent's jobs. And so I went to Lancaster. I was newly married, 21 years old. Got my first superintendent's job. After getting his first job as a superintendent, Matt was eager to move up in the industry. I wasn't making any money. And my dad came down and he said, what are you doing? And so that's when I, I started to apply for jobs and I couldn't get them. And Wade Hampton was the one that straw that bro broke the camel's back. They were building it. I thought I was a shoe in I built two golf courses, Mr. Cornish, and I thought I'm gonna get this job and I didn't even get an interview. One of his mentors encouraged him to take a step back in his role from superintendent to assistant superintendent and to get a job at a well-known course to build his pedigree. Matt took the advice and got a job at a prestigious course in Georgia, and it proved to be a springboard to his career. So he said, you need to start over. So we sold everything we owned, started over. So, you know, it all worked, but it was hard. His experience there helped him to continue to rise in the industry. A few years later, he moved back to a superintendent role at Woodcrest Country Club in Voorhees, New Jersey, and eventually on to the Country Club of Cleveland, and ultimately to Marion. His career now includes hosting several major championships, including the 2013 U.S. Open at Marion Golf Club. I was there two and a half years, started making six figures, and then from there it was like game on. 